game with Phoenix Longevity Arts and we have Eric Delgado here uh, assisting me on our big hike in Northern Arizona. I always used to watch the black and white footage of Bruce Lee in his tournaments he would try to promote himself in. He would always throw the one inch punch and if you watch carefully, he's got somebody up there in a karate uniform with a chair behind and when he does the one inch punch, it's so dramatic the karate guy fall over the chair on the ground and the crowd goes, oh god. So, we can always make our punches dramatic as well. The one inch punch is real. I teach in my school three different kinds of punches. One kind of punch hurts the ribs. It's kind of like a, a surface style punch, just snapping to the stomach or to the ribs. The next kind of punch uses like pushing action. It's trying to hit really, really deep, pushing in. Not hurting the ribs, but hurting into like the liver or the internal organs, knocking the air out. And then the third punch combines both. You want to have the heavy hands and hit in, bang! It's the push and the snap combined. And the one inch punch is this kind of punch. So we have our hand on the stomach. We don't pull away. We want to have the snap and the heavy hands combined together. We want to hit, boom, right in this way and send them back. It's a real punch. Try it at home. Get a partner who's nice, kind, and willing to let you hit them. Like Eric's a nice guy. Get a partner, trust each other, and try this punch, and practice it every single day. This guy's gonna get good abs. I'm gonna get good punches. We both will improve, and I'll see you next time. Check out the view.